Picture a hidden lab deep in ancient India, alchemists working with glowing liquid metal. Mercury texts like the Rasarnava called it Parada, a magical substance they believed it could cure diseases or grant immortality. But here's the thing. Mercury is deadly. Even today, a single drop can poison a river. So why did they risk it? In 2001, a thermometer factory in Kodaikana leaked mercury workers got sick, hair fell out, hands shook. Now imagine warriors 1,500 years ago drinking mercury elixirs. Did they know the danger? Ancient texts say they purified mercury for medicine, but some recipes sound like science fiction. One formula claims mercury could turn iron into gold, another says it made warriors invincible. But here's the mystery. No one's found proof of mercury weapons. Then there's the UN. In 2017, they banned mercury in factories through the Minamata Convention. Not because of ancient secrets, but because mercury poisons us even today. So why does a 13th century text, Rasa Ratna Samakaya, warn about mercury's fiery breath? Was it a metaphor or a warning? I'll leave you with this. In Delhi, a 2019 study found unsafe mercury levels in pregnant women. Our past and present are tied to this liquid metal. Did ancient alchemists discover something we've forgotten? Or were they chasing a deadly dream? If you want more stories like this, where science meets mystery, hit like and subscribe. We're digging up history's buried secrets, one drop of mercury at a time.